Die Oper erzählt die Geschichte eines jungen Adeligen, der in seine beste Freundin verliebt ist. Er traut sich aber nicht, ihr seine Liebe zu gestehen und überhäuft sie stattdessen als anonymer Liebhaber mit Geschenken, Blumen und Liebesbriefen. I am playing Joseph Ballon, Chevalier de Saint-Georges. Uh, he, was, he was good at everything. He's one of those people. Imagine someone who's better than you at everything and that's kind of this guy. Wir haben diese kurzweilige romantische Komödie mit dem abenteuerlichen Leben Joseph Bolognes, dem Komponisten der Oper, verschnitten. Denn wie der anonyme Liebhaber in der Oper, so war es auch diesem Komponisten zum Teil nicht vergönnt, sein Liebesleben publik und öffentlich zu leben. Ein schwarzer Mann im 18. Jahrhundert in Frankreich konnte keine offizielle Beziehung mit einer weißen Frau eingehen. He was born in Guadeloupe to a slave mother and a slave master father. Um, and they moved to Paris where he started his education and became, he studied everything and people were bullying him, but he clearly uh, superseded their ability and they had to respect him. Yeah, he's, he's had an interesting journey. And I think besides his life, his legacy is even more interesting. We have lots of people who are interested in the subject now and, uh, Making sure it's historically accurate is quite difficult, so it's great to play a character that's on trend, as they say. In this opera, you'll not only get a very charming love story, but in addition to that, you'll get lovely, beautiful melodies that are evocative to the same time period and style as you would hear if you know works by Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart or Joseph Haydn. So it's uh, very tuneful, very varied melodies, and it, um, it's just like a nice, wonderful evening full of great music.